so here we find a elephant carcass. I can't even tell you how many vultures picking on it. I mean they're just and about inside of it. That's no, this is not old because nothing has decayed yet. I mean this is like yesterday. Anything I can imagine that it was run down. Hit by a truck probably. Yeah, and then they had to move it to the side of the road. But interesting how they eat. They go inside the whole carcass. I mean there are, I don't know how many, let me try and see if I can show you. How many vultures are sitting around here. I mean the carcass hasn't even begun to start smelling yet so this is very new. And this is what you get in the bush. So we're back at the elephant carcass that we saw yesterday. And there are about, I would say, seven or eight yeah. right in the area. But you can listen to him eating this now. They have incredibly strong jaws. They can bite through that skin and through that bone. Here comes another what one. What is he looking at, Stuart? He's it? looking at something. Yeah, another hyena's coming. They're trying to come in, but they're not letting them come. <laughs> they heard something. Yeah, now, and I heard something's it too. coming. Something is coming. Let me show you while we're looking at that. There's another hyena in the road, yeah. There's a lot of vultures on that tree there. And I'll just pan across here and show you the vultures there. And these are the only ones that we can see in the trees. There's some on the ground. You can see. There's another one. It looks like a small one. Yeah. So I don't know where this one comes from. But they're very wary to get on that kill with this, with this other hyena here. So here comes this one here now. Let's see what he's going to do. So in the bushes we have one, two, three, all sitting waiting. Four, five here on the road. So the, these are hyenas that are on the outside. These two in the road and the three in the bush obviously from a different clan because the ones on the kill keep on chasing them away. So this one's coming here to the kill. No, they don't, no, they don't no, want the others to come. They don't want them there. They're trying to get in, but they're not letting them in. Look at the saliva that is drooling out of his mouth. Ugh, it's gross. He's pulling at the skin to try and open it. The others are all waiting around to see where they can get a chance to get in here. She's biting at the skin. Unbelievable. That skin is so tough. Look how she just bites at it. Back on it again.
And these guys in the road have just decided to wait it out. And uh, no point in standing around, so they lying down and just waiting their turn. Just trying to bite that bone, I don't know why. Very cautious, she's always looking around. Well, I think she's keeping off the other ones. There's another one coming out of the bush up, up ahead there. She bites that bone. Make quite a dent into that bone. Look, look, look how she bites it. I wonder why they're eating the bone. Yeah. And not the flesh. She um, can get there. And this is something in the bone that she wants. Yeah. I mean, she's getting. She's just going for that bone. Could be something to do with their teeth. Licking the cartilage or something in that bone, did you? Mm. Yeah, they like something in that bone because as she breaks it open, she licks it. So, another one has just come out of the bush to join these three that are waiting. This one has got up and chased away the other two. They've gone up about 10 feet into the bush and are just watching what's going on here. Yeah, here they come back. I think this all has to do with pecking order. This one seems to be the more dominant of these three. So this is the next morning. And there is very little left of that elephant. This is the third day we're watching it. In three days, the hyenas and the vultures have absolutely annihilated this elephant carcass. Tugging at the foot. She's a couple of different vultures coming in here. Look at the foot. Can you see they're tugging at the foot? Hmm. There's mostly cape vultures and white back vultures here. And this old hyena is so full, he can hardly move, or she can hardly move. Her stomach is bulging. She's been eating all night, just standing in the road. We'll take a look on our way back and see what what is left, but these vultures aren't really just going for it. That hyena is trying to get in there, but he's a little bit outnumbered. Oh, she, she's a little bit outnumbered. Yeah, she tries to chase them off. And of course, one thing you can't get on this video is the smell this rotting, smelly carcass. But there it is. Well, this is our last visit to this elephant carcass. There's virtually nothing left of it except skin. Dried skin and bones. There's the skull. Still some vultures. Finishing off the last pieces. And that's it. It was an elephant, it's now just a pile of bones and skin. <laughs>